Is your Ford Focus um, vibrating a lot at idle, making a lot of like rattling noises and like stuff shaking inside and stuff like that? This is a very, very, very common cause of that. The engine mount wears down, the rubber like causes it to the um, engine to go down and the mount will touch the uh, actually contact the uh, metal of the mount itself. The rubber will touch it. And so that's called grounding out. And that causes a lot of vibrations to resonate and since it's touching it doesn't like eliminate the uh, resonation noise so for twenty dollars or thirty dollars you can get an insert pull this mount off and put it on or for fifty to eighty dollars you get the whole thing and you just bolt it right in and it's and it's fixed it'll be like driving a brand new car again it trust me it makes a huge difference when that's brand new versus wore out. In order to replace it, you uh, get a jack with a piece of wood on it to um, roll it underneath and and uh, jack up the engine a little bit with the wood in between the jack face and the oil pan on the engine. Raise it until you see this lift off a little bit. Um, to, you'll see the rubber raise up a little bit. Um, uh, pop the coolant bottle out out of the ridges there move it aside uh, You'll actually move it that direction um, And then you uh, with the engine supported on the bottom of the jack you take these two 15 millimeter bolts off one here and One here that you can't see but it's on the other side of that bracket Okay, and then you take these two 18 millimeter nuts off once again with the engine supported um, once you take the nuts off, the studs may come off with it. Uh, put it in a vise, take the, separate the nut from the stud, run the nut in, or stud in separately first without any, without any, uh, nut on it. Uh, that's an inverted Torx head. Run that, yeah, like I said, run that down into the block there. Um, that way it'll, you'll make sure the, uh, nut and everything's seated properly and it won't rip out of the engine down the road, so put the stud back in first and then the nut uh, yeah so hope that helps really simple repair uh, good luck to you and thanks for watching